took me 34 years to realize how lucky I am. Then, one of the most beautiful countries that I ever traveled in my life is my home country, Switzerland. In the last 10-20 years, suspension bridges have been becoming incredibly popular and I was still surprised as I found a list of over 150 suspension bridges in my little country. So I did a lot of hikes this year and I was focusing on the most interesting suspension bridges. From the longest, the tallest, until the most incredible bridge, each one is a unique in his own way. In this video I want to present you my top 12 suspension bridges from Switzerland. For those who can't wait, I divided the video in different chapters. Also you can find the information about each bridge in the video description below. And that's it, let's go into the video. Number 12. La Passerelle et Farine. The bridge is located in the middle of the vineyard in the canton of Valais and connects the two municipalities, Saint-Lon and Léon. This bridge was built in 2001 and with the length of 90-70 meters it leads over the spectacular Gorge Salens at the height of 136 meters. Number 11. Andekfall Bridge. This area holds a special place in my heart. After a week bike and camp, we checked into the Natur Resort Hotel next to this bridge. We had a great dinner, the most comfortable bed, a breakfast buffet like I never saw before, 12 hour spa and this bridge in the garden inclusive. The construction connects with his 70 meters length, the hotel resort and the well known Gellner Bahn. Number 10. Suspension Bridge Hostalden. This bridge is 155 meters long and was built in 2006 by just one family. And the reason is simple. On one side there is the main road and on the other side is the home of the family who has to cross the river every day to get to work or to school. They are used years before a small handmade bridge at the bottom of the valley, which lead them only a few centimeters above the height course of the river. So quite risky and depending on the river, the family plans a safety solution. In cooperation with a local cable car builder, the family was able to realize this safety suspension bridge. Number 9. Suspension Bridge by Sigriswil. This massive tourist attraction is 344 meters long and connects the two villages of Sigriswil and Ashland at the height of 180 meters above the valley floor. This bridge is part of a 56 km walk loop around Lake Thun. To cross the suspension bridge you have to pay 8 Swiss francs per person. But in the end, I want to say that this one is one of the longest suspension bridges from Switzerland and still an architecture masterpiece. Number 8. Subtle Skywalk. An architecture masterpiece is this bridge too. In first line, made for tourists, but the 374 meters construction is a statement by himself. This massive bridge is built in 2010 and has a similar construction than the one in Sigriswil, but 30 meters longer and so the second longest bridge on my list. Funny fact on this point, it was planned that this bridge will be the longest footbridge in the world, but due to poor research she missed the record by just a few meters. Number 7. Ponte di Petano Carasso. With the Monte Carasso cable car, we get up to the picturesque Corsut middle station. From there is it a 45 minutes hike along the stone-built villages through the forest 
and with a breathtaking view to reach the Tibetana suspension bridge. The elegant bridge made with large wood is part of the cultural circle hike and is 270 meters long and weighed about 50 tons. And it allows to cross the impassable valley that separates the municipalities of Monte Carrasso and Cementina. Number 6. The Goms Bridge. First to know it is a year-round tourist attraction and second with his 1.4 meters wide it is suitable for hikers, bikes and wheelchair friendly. It also sways a bit and in addition it is free to cross. The bridge was built in 2015 and leads on a height about 92 meters over the valley ground. At 280 meters, the Goms Bridge is one of the longest bridges in Switzerland and connects the two areas of Bellwald and Ernen. Number 5. Aspititer Suspension Bridge. This bridge is one of the most spectacular suspension bridges from Switzerland and it is located in the barest landscape above Fiesch. The way from Bellwald to the bridge is a highlight itself and leads over narrow ramps and step stairs down to the epic bridge. As we arrived on the bridge, the feeling was just breathtaking. What shall I say? This is just one of the most beautiful places on earth. A masterpiece in sky, between two massive rocks in the barest nature. The Aspititer suspension bridge is 160 meters long and across the gorge at the highest of 120 meters. Number 4. The Majestically Drift Bridge With the drift cable car you get up into the valley. At the bottom station it's a hike of one and a half hours until the majestically imposing bridge appears in the nearest point. The bridge is 170 meters long and leads at the highest of 100 meters above the bottom of the valley. This was my first visit to a suspension bridge of this size and I'm still amazed when I see these pictures. I had to really keep my focus on my drone in order not to look down too much and across the bridge at the same time. This experience definitely hit me and let the idea grow to finally create this video. Number 3. The Suspension Bridge by Müren. This bridge is part of the Via Verata by Müren and definitely an adventure experience. I almost shit in my pants because of the shaky construction that leads over that deep gorge. There is no real handrail, only a safety line for the harness, but the view down is epic. A unique bridge that offered me an experience that I will never forget. Ah, 
A big thanks on this point to Paddy who created these great POV shots. Thanks man. Number 2. The Bridge New York. This bridge is exactly 100 years old, built in 1922, and by far the oldest bridge on my list. The bridge was built to carry aqueduct across the gorge. The result is a 200 meter long and 190 meters high bridge. Today this is history and the adrenaline chunkies have taken over the red suspension bridge. In addition to the classic bungee jump, there is also a rope jump and for chickens like me, the possibility to cross the valley hanging on a zip line. With the history, the construction and the adventure offer, this bridge is my personality number two. Number one, the king. Charlie Squone Suspension Bridge. The scenery itself was already a highlight, with yellow color of the large forest in the autumn style. I have literally experienced almost all different weather conditions changing within minutes. After one and a half hours hike, an overwhelming moment as I entered the construction. After the rain and the fog had blown away, I get rewarded with the most beautiful autumn weather I can ever imagine and was able to take these beautiful shots with a drone. The bridge was opened in 2017 to replace the Europe Bridge, which was damaged by a rockfall in the summer of 2010, just two months after completion. A great comeback. At 494 meters, the bridge was the longest pedestrian suspension bridge in the world for four years. The construction is 58 tons and across at the height of 85 meters, the unsafety rockfall area. And that's already it. I hope I inspired you with this video to get out in the nature and believe in Mother Earth like I do. Smash the like button and follow me for more. Stay nature.